Hey guys, Survival Bob here, and I want to talk about nanites. I've got uh, something that's been bothering me. Uh, I've got several nanite videos out. Uh, maybe you've seen them, but if you haven't, um, we talk about different ways to make nanites. One of the ways we talk about is uh, that you can refine platinum. And I've gotten lots of comments that say, uh, refine platinum with gold and silver, it's a better yield. This is the way to do it. It's the best way, uh, stuff like that. So anyway, so I wanted to test it and see what everybody was talking about. Maybe I'm missing something, guys. Let's take a look here. All right, so we got a stack of platinum. A stack of platinum is a 35 to one ratio. If I take that stack, I can refine it into 285 nanites. It takes a minute, that's super quick. That's the best thing about this method is it's quick. Uh, I, I think it's a crappy return. This platinum's worth 5 million units. If I sell it, I can scrap a couple ships for that and I can make way more than 285. Now. Yes, it'll take me more than a minute and a half. So you got me there. But, uh, so let's see what we get when we slap gold and silver in here. So we slap gold, nothing. We slap silver in here. And now we get 399, which is better than 285. You get 25 platinum, 15 gold, and 15 silver is going to give you one nanite cluster, which is one nanite, basically. Uh, that's not a better return. Am I doing the math wrong? It's 399, right? Uh, so this gold and silver will refine into one to one, so I can get you know a, a full stack of platinum out of that. And a full stack of platinum was worth, as we saw, 285. 285 times two is more than 395, which is what we get with a stack of gold, silver, and platinum. And this takes two minutes and 23 seconds. So what am I missing here? I mean, I guess it's a lot faster to do it that way than to refine the gold and silver into platinum, but you do lose on yield. And it's still not near what other methods are for the, for the resources, in my opinion. All right, guys, so tell me what this is about. Am I missing something? Uh, I, I just don't see it. I don't see it. Plus the value of that gold, silver, and platinum. Let me let me look at that real quick. So the value of the platinum is five million. The value of the gold is three and a half million. So that's eight and a half. Plus another 1.8. So let's just call it 10, 10, 3. Okay? It's probably a little closer to 10, 4. Definitely closer to 10, 4. So 10 million right here to get even if we refine this in the platinum and then refine that again, uh, is only going to give us 500 and some odd. So I don't get it. I don't get it. I don't get it. Now, if you, um, now maybe you've got a platinum and gold farm and you got more money than you need and you just, you know, do this while you watch YouTube videos or, um, it's just kind of something to do and you don't care about the money. If, if that's, that's your gameplay style. Cool. Totally respect that. There's nothing wrong with that. But if we're talking about the most efficient way to do it, that ain't efficient. Um, if we're talking about the best use of resources, that ain't the best use of resources. If we're talking about the fastest, um, I don't know, I don't know. I'd like to race somebody who's got a bunch of refiners set up or something. I feel like I could get more scrapping um, and spend less money than they could. But maybe I'm wrong. Maybe they've got you know 500 refiners and they've been saving platinum for a month. From their uh, from their minds, I don't know, but it just doesn't seem like the best way to do it for me. So, guys, if I'm missing something, if you see something I don't, please let me know in the comments. Uh, there are some new ways to do to to get nanites. You can refine uh, tainted metal now. Uh, tainted metal is uh, something else I'm seeing popping up as a uh, something you can do. You get two nanites for every tainted metal, so that's actually a pretty good return. Um, but it does take a long time, nine minutes and 54 seconds. The tainted metal is what you use to buy the upgrades from the scrap dealer. You know, to get the tainted metal, you gotta run a freighter. Uh, unless you're duplicating tainted metal using one of the duping methods, uh, I, I, I wouldn't even do that. Now, if you wanna dupe tainted metal, if that's how you roll, knock yourself out. I don't, I don't do that, that's not how I roll. But, uh, but yeah, so I've seen those new methods popping up in the comments lately on my videos, and I wanted to bring that to people's attention. There are ways you can do it, but 
I was talking about the most efficient way. I think scrapping is still a very valid method. Uh, it probably is getting beat now by cooking and feeding a Kronos because the double exotic spawn is gone and nobody's found another one yet. If you want to learn more about nanites and different ways to make them, check out these videos here. If you've got a more efficient way, please let me know. We'll test it out. We'll give it a try and uh, see if it works. Guys, this is Survival Bob. If you're going to be a Bob, have fun with it. And uh, if you're going to make nanites, you know, uh, do it. Do it efficiently or, you know, do it however the hell you want. <laughs> you do you. All right, guys. You do you. All right, guys. We'll see you next time.